Hi! Okay, I'm going to teach you how to use the chrome key effect on VideoPad, okay? I'm going to show you step by step, okay? Okay, let's start out with something basic, okay? I'm going to be making one of my music videos on here while I'm doing this so it's not a total waste of time. Okay. First, I'm going to take the music that I need. Mm. Hmm. Okay. Okay, and then I'm gonna put that on the timeline up here, so the way back there for some reason. Okay, and then I'm going to add the pitch here. I'm going to use okay. I'm going to put that, and I'm gonna pull it all the way back to how long I want it. Okay, now, here's the part I'm getting the chrome key, okay? You click, um, overlay track, and then you browse for your clip. Okay. Okay, and then you click use chrome key, alright? And you choose what color it is. Okay, and then you adjust it. Sometimes you have to go back to adjust it because sometimes it's hard. Because it, it can it can get complicated. So you want to go through here and see how it is. Okay. See, at some parts the green screen shows. So you want to go back and uh, fix that up. Hmm. Okay, you can do that by uh, doing Chrome key select. It's right here just to edit it. Okay, take more of that out. Okay, it's still there. Okay, uh, maybe I'll choose different color. Uh, a little lighter. Okay. Okay, now let's try this. All right. It looks to have worked. Okay, and you don't want these little black lines here that sometimes show up when uh, the the screen isn't full. So for that, you go to Effects and you can Crop. Just pull in the sides here. Okay, there. And then you have to wait for it to load down here. Like, the more editing and the more clips that you put in, because you can put more than one overlay clip, the more editing and clips that you put in, the longer it's going to take to load up. This will actually probably take quite a while. See, it's only a little bit loaded there. Okay, anyway, at the end of the video, I hope you guys have fun making your little green screen effects. Yeah.